Hey, you joined me here in the theater again. I got my uh, my glass of wine. Mm. So uh, another little review for you. So I just watched Napoleon Dynamite. Oops, upside down. Napoleon Dynamite. Uh, vote for Pedro. It's actually pretty cool. It's a two disc set. So it's got the, the movie and then special features. Um, this movie. So I watched this movie. Gosh, when it first came out in the theater with my wife. We went to the theater to watch it. And we thought, oh my gosh, it's going to be hilarious. It's going to be good. It's going to be a great movie. Um, and neither one of us liked it. We thought it was absolutely insane. It was, at the time, we're like, it's not funny. Actually, I liked it more than she liked it. She hated it. She absolutely hated it. Uh, but she was like, yeah, it's not funny. It's stupid, blah, blah, blah. And I'm like, I haven't seen it since. I mean, I've, I've owned it. Uh, I've owned this movie for a few years. But I haven't watched it. And so I watched it. And... <clears throat> it's, I wouldn't say it's necessarily funny. It's stupid, silly. It's, of course, all on purpose. All the acting, all the silliness, all the stupidness and stuff that they, they do, it's all on purpose. And it's kind of a nice movie to sit and relax to and just kind of enjoy and just kind of like, you know, it's nothing serious or anything. Um... I still think the chapstick thing is one of my favorites. Um, or the alpaca, you know, with grandma and the alpaca. Um, but um, I'd say it's a good movie. I, I, If you like something that's just chill and relax, definitely try this out. Um, Napoleon Dynamite is, is all around. It, it It's stupid. Heads up, it's absolutely stupid. But it's not terrible um it's definitely quite kind of interesting they filmed it um in the mid so it's supposed to have been filmed in the mid 80s of course it wasn't it was filmed much much um earlier than that but or later than that but um try it vote for pedro napoleon dynamite i'd say it was a good one so thumbs up for me